It's the ninth day of Fashion Week in New York, and we are just as excited as we were in the beginning, but we are getting a little bit worn out. <laughs> um, we realized this morning something that's so, so, so sad to us. We missed the Christian Cowan show. We were so honored and thrilled when we found out we were included. Now we're headed to our first market appointment of the day. We have a full day today and a full day tomorrow. And then I get on the plane to go back to Birmingham at 9 p.m. So we're never stopping for a moment. We're never stopping to even catch our breath, I feel like. How are you this morning? Doing well. Obviously sad about the show, but what happens is after the show's end, I guess for editors and influencers, New York Fashion Week is done. But for buyers and for us, it is heavy, very intense market. So after the shows are happening, then you're having market appointments. So that can be happening on a day when you have both market appointments and shows. And then once actually all the shows have ended, then it is lots and lots of appointments back to back and you hope that you're not running late and that everything goes as planned which of course it never does right it never does but we do the best we can and usually in new york the very last show is a nighttime show and it's mark jacobs and so that took place last night and now a lot of people are getting on the plane to head to london and we are not this time so we're kind of sad about that too but we are looking forward to the market appointments that we have today where we really get to see the pieces up close and meet the designers Nobody knows, trying to hide but it shows Lost my sense of logical Think that I'm gonna explode Echoes inside of my bones Not the brave kind, never dare to Take the leap when the chance is coming You are special, ordinary Can get you out of my mind I'm gonna do it So we have a couple minutes before our next appointment and earlier when we were finding lunch we saw Chacha Macha but that's not really a lunch place but now we can go and get a matcha so we're so excited BB is thrilled as am I so look at all this pink and green BB's holding the door thank you Okay, BB's doing the taste test. <gasps> oh, what do you think? Okay, well, what are your initial thoughts? Excellent. <laughs> do you love me so much, BB? Yes. <laughs>
So Fashion Week is winding down. This is our last day. I'm catching a flight at nine o'clock tonight and we are headed to several fun appointments. We're gonna go see the new collection from Prabal and then we're gonna go see the new collection from Tibby and then we have two more that I can't really remember right this second. Brandon Maxwell. Oh, that's huge, yeah. And Goods and Services Showroom, so they have Nanushka and lots of other fun brands. Which is great. So all four of those brands are amazing brands. And what I wanna ask all of you is, if you watch these videos that we make about Fashion Week and we're talking about all these different brands and we show you things from the shows and things like that, if you see anything that catches your eye, please direct message us send us an email a comment in this YouTube video just say I think this is cool give me some more details don't worry about the price if it's a price point I'm looking very um, diligently for great brands with a range of pricing so if you see something you love and then I say this is who made it and this is the price and you say that's not for me no big deal I know what kind of things you all are interested in and then I can keep up the hunt right and Delia will too so please please we'd love to have your feedback about what you're seeing and um, what are the things in your life that you feel like are missing in your wardrobe just left the Prabal appointment and now we are downtown on Wall Street trying to figure out where to eat lunch and of course we're not really familiar with the area so <laughs> we're a little bit lost. What are y'all gonna eat for lunch? I've never been there so I don't Me know. Either. Something good. <laughs> One can hope. So we arrived at Dig In and please look at the line. It is Wall Street at lunchtime. This is insane. Okay here's the line. <laughs> we cannot go here, so we're gonna <laughs> try and go somewhere. <laughs> Are y'all hungry? Starving. <laughs> Are we gonna make it to Tivi on time? Yes. Is on that 1:30? You betcha. Okay. Should we go see the bull? Oh, oh yeah, we should. We can go to the stock exchange and say hello. To, to all the people friends. in there, yeah. Let's go ring the bell. I wonder if there might be an IPO happening. We don't want to miss out. We have ended up at Cipriani's because BB wanted to go here the whole time. The door's opening. Wall Street at lunchtime. Wouldn't recommend it. Okay, BB, how do you take your coffee? No meal over the half and half. Oatmeal? Oat milk. <laughs> That's what it is. <laughs> okay, so that's what she did, and guess what? You sweeten it, don't you? I do, which makes you very upset. But uh, like Aunt Katie has all sugar. Oh wow! I at least do, you know, Splenda or Equal or Stevia. Oh, that's good. Okay, now Fletcher, how do you take your coffee? As is nothing in it. Completely black. black. Yes. That's what Mitch does. No sugar. No sugar. Nothing. No milk. Nothing. Okay, how does how does Delia take her coffee? Well, glad you <laughs> a cappuccino. I don't I don't even know the milk, but usually it would be oat skim. Actually, I'm more relaxed about milk right now. So really, I guess whatever comes out of the milk. That's sure. I'm more relaxed because with skim, they told me that they take out all the good things and they add in sugar and chemicals. So that's they take out the fat. Right. So I'm very confused about what I should have. I have no idea what I should be drinking. Either full fat milk or which is upsetting because if I feel like full fat, you're going to get fat. 
I know. No, you don't use a lot of it. Well, yeah, but when I have my smoothies with a cup of milk. Oh. All right. So anyway, you can't win. And then when you start having oat milk, then you don't get the calcium from right. the actual milk. So then you're really in trouble. My bones are going to break. I've never broken you a bone. You do a half a cup of almond milk and a half a cup of cream milk. Okay. Signing off. started off this morning at Prabal Karan showroom and we got to see the fall collection up close. We saw the show and then we got to see the pieces today. And a lot of times there's things from the runway, some of them aren't put into production. We saw some things that are really going to be great that maybe weren't on the runway or clothes that really women can wear. We got to talk to Prabal for a minute and he's very excited about the response he's had to that collection, which we definitely can see why. It's spectacular, and um, then we have some fun things in the works with them, so stay tuned about that. Thank you everyone so much for watching the Style Defines Us Take New York Fashion Week for Fall 19. Stay tuned in six months when all these pieces come out. Let us know if you love any of the brands or if you have any questions or feedback for next Fashion Month. Yes, please and please, any brand, any item that you see that you're interested in, direct message us, send us a note in the comments, let us know the things you're interested in because that's why we're here. We want you to discover all these fabulous brands as we do and as we share them with you. It's really the whole goal. So, that's all I've got to say. <laughs> Well, you're being filmed, so Annalise is probably... Oh, my. Hi, Annalise. Don't put that part in here.